Hey guys, it's Demi. How are you all doing? I hope life's treating you well and I hope you're doing okay. For today's video, I'm super excited because I haven't done a haul in a long time and I'm going to be doing one of my favourite hauls of all time, which is a Cherries haul. I've worked with Cherries many a times before and I am excited to let you know that I am working with them in collaboration with this video. If you don't know what Cherries is, it is basically everything you want from your bargain shops like home bargains and b&m but on an app so you don't even have to leave your house and you can go scrolling in your bargain shops and i just think that is absolutely genius if you've never used cherries before and you are a new cherries customer i can get you a discount code demi25 it'll get you 25 percent off your first order and it'll also get you free shipping on your next two orders after that that will just be applied automatically the next times you shop on cherries if you are an existing cherries customer i can get you free delivery on your next order just using the code demi free will get you free delivery which is very exciting because who wants to pay for delivery not me not you don't pay for it we don't have to demi free will get you free delivery code demi free is valid from the 19th of november until the 3rd of december so another quick feature at cherries that i want to tell you about because it is very valuable is team buying feature Basically, I spoke about this last time I talked about cherries, but it is essentially a feature where you can create your own team and anybody who joins that team, once somebody in the team makes an order and then if you make an order at the same time as them, you will all get... You all get essentially money back through Cherries Cash, which is a kind of money on the Cherries app that you can spend, which means you can get free products and stuff like that. Really cool, um, and I would definitely recommend creating your own team, or if you don't want to do that, you can be part of my team. I'll have the link in the description below, which means anytime somebody orders, if you make an order within that certain time period as well, you will get Cherries Cash back. Not only are we able to save a bit of money using Cherries, the discount store, but we can also get a little bit of money back by using the Cherries team buying feature as well. So it's super good, but but without further ado, I'm going to show you some of the things that I picked up and I'm really excited because the Christmas has finally started for me. Christmas shopping has started and I am starting to prepare for Christmas just a tiny bit. I haven't gone all out and got loads of Christmas stuff because in all honesty, I want to get everything down from the loft, see what I've got and see what I haven't and then start making my big Christmas purchases. But I have picked up a few bits and bobs that I've seen that I know would come in very useful. So if you're excited for Christmas, get yourself a cuppa. I am actually using a Christmas mug. It's that time of year. I have to use a Christmas mug now. It's a bit legal not to, isn't it? Because autumn is gone. No more autumn mugs. Get your Christmas mugs out. I actually got this one in Asda last year for about £4. So I'm going to start with the Christmas stuff. Now I have kind of put all the items that I got in kind of categories. So we're a little bit organised. So I am going to go Christmas first because... I'm just a bit excited about the things that I picked up. So, last year, I did not have a tree topper. And I didn't have one throughout the full Christmas. Did I commit a crime? Is that a crime? Probably, yeah. Should I be sent to Christmas jail? Probably, yeah. Because I didn't have a tree topper. But, this year, don't worry, we'll have one. I picked this up from Cherries. It's a gold tree. Now, what I liked about this, even though it's gold, it's not, like, a really ugly gold. It's kind of on the edge of, like, a rose gold. But this is a rose gold tree top at Star. So, I picked this up just so if I forget to pick one up this year. Well, I won't forget now because I have one. But I didn't want to be without anything on the top of my tree again. Because I thought that, that would be a little bit bad. The next thing I picked up is just a little selection of sweets. This will be so handy to give to somebody as a stocking filler. There's actually a really good selection of sweets in there. Like, if I wasn't vegan, this would be the perfect selection box for me. Then I also picked up my first Christmas candle, which I'm so excited for. So, this is a Yankee candle. And it's in unwrap the magic it's one of the mini ones this is what it looks like might need to scrape it a bit because the wick is like tight then also picked up this this is just a bar of marzipan this is actually a little stock and filler for someone in my family who i know loves marzipan so i thought i would pick it up while i remember i then also picked up this hydrate and go little nivea set so it comes with a water bottle it comes with a moisturizing cream a rich moisturizing shower cream and a lip balm i just thought this was so cute and i love the fact it come with a bottle also on the nivea men's section i picked up this stock and filler which comes in a huge like travel bag which would be really handy for whoever i give it to, to like keep and then this comes with um it comes with quite a bit actually it comes with all these products here yeah, so you have a shower gel uh, what is that a care shampoo a um deodorant a cream and then a lip balm so i thought this was really handy and like i said i really like the bag and it's a decent size <clears throat> The next thing I got is a pack of three tea towels and it, this I just fell in love with. It says have yourself a cosy little Christmas. How cute that's going to look on the radiator in the Christmas 
in the Christmas tree. How cute is that going to look on the radio and the kitchen? I love it. So it's a pack of three tea towels. So you get have yourself a cosy little Christmas, a tartan print one, and then a one with like the quotes on, but like in the sides. God, I am shit at describing things like actually rubbish. Okay, the next things. So that is like the Christmas stuff, but I have got other Christmas themed stuff within the other sections you'll see anyway the next thing i got is two storage boxes like this i just think these would be so handy to store stuff on top of my walk-in wardrobe because i've got like loads of things up there that just need like to look a bit neater so that was my idea for the toilet roll because it's a bit of an essential and on to food and kind of kitchen essentials i got some big as sizzle as tweet tweets <laughs> treats for the puffs this is what they look like so i just picked up these i've never actually had these ones to be completely honest but i thought they'd like them who doesn't like a little bit of bacon treat around the christmas also got some cans of j2o so i got the apple and raspberry j2o and then i also got the orange and passion fruit my personal favorite one I then also got some of the mayflower curry mix this is honestly one of the best curry mixes it makes like such a beautiful chinese style curry i then also got some sweeteners for my dad comes around he likes a sweetener in his tea and i had about two left so i knew i needed to stop up got some coffee honestly i'm one of these people that like the difference between cheap and expensive coffee literally means nothing to me so i pick up the one pound coffee and that might really annoy people but i've never had anyone complain about me coffee yet although we do have a machine which has ground coffee and if people are there i do tend to put the machine on but in the morning i just whack the kettle on i like an instant coffee where sean uses the machine religiously i then also got some oxo cubes really random but i had a craving for some oxo oxo cubes the other day and i thought mm, i could just have like a pot uh, i could just have a cup of oxo right now so i got some of the beef ones because these are actually accidentally vegan i then also picked up some 100 percent pure coconut oil so handy for skincare but also in the kitchen as well using as a um, alternative to a coconut oil and then a tomato sauce i feel like these are a cupboard essential in my house and i got the tomato and basil one by lloyd gossman so that was all the foodie kitchen bits that i picked up okay these are just some random things that i picked Picked up i got a foldable fabric storage bag in pink i actually picked two of these up because i want to put some stuff in for under the bed i then also got some little cupcake um things because i want to make some banana cake i've got a packet of like banana cake recipe thing in the cupboard and i've been meaning to do it for the longest time but i wanted to make cupcake versions and i didn't have any of these so here we go then also got this which i swear i ordered the dog one but i mustn't have because i've ended up getting the cat one but it's basically a mat to put in the pup's room to stop their balls sliding around. So I just picked up this. I mean, it is a cat, but I like my dogs to be friendly with everyone. So this isn't a problem. And then I also picked up one of these spoons. I just find these super handy for scooping out the pup's food. So my pups do have a home-cooked diet. And I find these spoons really handy to kind of monitor how much they're having. And then in kitchen as well, I also picked up one of these. These are really handy, again, for when you're, like, flipping things in the pan, stuff like that. So I like these. What is this even called? A turner. A silicone turner. I then also picked up these. These are the self-glue metal hooks. This is what they look like. I love these kind of self gluey things i use them all around the house and they're really handy for like in the back of cupboards to stay organized and then i also picked up this it's an in-sink colander so basically like you can put it on the sink and it'll drain your pasta or whatever you need to drain i just thought this was really handy and i really wanted to try it so i got it and then it also has this little section here so you can like allow your food to go back where you need it to um so yeah i picked up them moving on to cleaning products and cleaning essentials I picked up two Sephora's. I got the winter morning Sephora and then I also got the warm cinnamon Sephora. I was so surprised when I found out Sephora was a cruelty free brand and I was really happy about it. So I picked up two of these. I just feel like they do the best sense when it comes to Christmas. The winter morning one's my personal favourite but then I do like the warm cinnamon as well. So I picked up both of them. I then also picked up some of the Ace for White. This is one of my favourite products in the entire world. I love it so much especially when I'm doing a white load of washing. I just think it brings them out so crisp and nice i then also picked up this this is the astonished germ kill disinfectant with natural pine oil and um, this is the astonished brand i've been using a lot of astonished products recently because they are a cruelty free and vegan brand so i'm very happy that i got the abulosa is also another brand that i really like and this is one of my favorite scents from them it's the sage and vanilla so i picked up one of them disinfectant sprays i then also picked up some clean and bacon soda this is really good for like down your plug holes and i don't know i just find lots
lot of uses for baking soda to be honest so i picked up a bottle of that bin bags because we all need new bin bags every now and again so i got some new bin bags are these handled ones i hope so i usually always get the ones with handles but i don't think these have got handles that's kind of annoying nonetheless they're very useful I then also got some antibacterial wipes just because i think they're so handy if you have a little spillage or something like that just to give your bench a bit of a wipe instead of having to get your disinfectant spray out and everything so i do tend to always have a packet handy and then i also picked up this mini stool because my mom actually has one of these in her house and i remember borrowing it a few times when i lived there and they're so handy and i've actually found at the top of some of the kitchen cupboards i can't reach but also in the walk and wardrobe as well and i just thought this stool was so handy it's so compactable so i can just slide it away when i'm not needing it um so yeah i picked up a little folding stool which i felt i needed oh god i need a drink like desperately oh a bit on the strong side that one okay we're now moving on to like health and beauty stuff like that so the first thing in health and beauty that i picked up is two hand washers these again are both from astonish because i do really like the brand at the minute i picked up the essence of coconut and the soothing aloe vera one we go through hand wash so quick because obviously i feel like you need a lot of hand washes as well because we have one in the utility we we'll have one in the kitchen, one in the downstairs bathroom, one in the main bathroom and one in the ensuite. I think it's the fact we'll have three bathrooms that we get through them so quick. To be fair, the main bathroom, that one's been there for quite a while, the hand wash, because we don't seem to use that one very quick because I never really use that bathroom and neither does Sean. So that one has been quite loyal, but all of the other ones go really quick. Um, but yeah, so I picked up two of the big ones. I really like these because it's easy to get 30% extra product for free so i'm all here for the free stuff I then also picked up these these are just the normal always panty liners really handy just for everyday leakages or when you're on your period and you're near the end and then i also picked up these which are the ultra night sanitary pads i really right this is a funny story a bit tmi and i'm sorry if you're like a lad and we're going into period talk but this is just very random when i first started using pads i always always used the ones without the wings and i hated if my mom accidentally bought us the ones with the wings i found them so inconvenient but all of a sudden the last few years i'm more of a wing type of pad person now to be fair all in all i use tampons a lot more than i do pads but i do like to supply myself with both and yeah i do really like the ones with wings now so very random story but that is my story of the day and then i also picked up two shower gels so i use <coughs> So I just got two of the original sauce of coconut and shea butter shower gels. This again is a cruelty free and vegan brand and it's something that I am becoming increasingly aware of and making sure that I make conscious choices when I buy. I'm not perfect yet. I know some of the brands that I use are definitely not cruelty free and vegan, but I am trying to make more of a conscious effort when I'm buying products like that. Um, so when I find a product that is, I tend to just stick with it and buy that. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited about these and I really like the coconut ones because I think they smell so good. And then the last thing I picked up for Sean is the Dove Men um, Antiperspirant Deodorant. I didn't pick myself a deodorant up because I actually use the native deodorant which you can't get on cherries. But yeah, I thought this one would be handy for Sean. Um, so he's not got smelly pits. But that is everything that I picked up in cherries. Let us know any essentials that you're going to get below. Are you going to get any of the Christmas goodies? I'm so excited about everything that I got. I honestly feel so satisfied once I've done a haul of like essentials. And I go away putting it around and i go away putting the stuff out in the house dead proudly and i'm like oof i'm so proud of myself but yeah very excited very happy with everything that i picked up if you would like to see more videos from me then let us know by giving this a thumbs up if you want to see more cherries haul more bargain haul more come shop with me's then let us know by giving this video a thumbs up subscribe down below if you haven't already and i hope you're getting as excited for christmas as i am i'm going to have lots of christmas content coming soon so stay tuned for that but without further attack, i'm going to let you go and i'll see you very shortly for another video bye